You lost so me, I lost so you. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This mod is ridiculous. Have you ever thought to yourself that the modding community in Totally Accurate Battle Simulator has gone too far? I've thought that from time to time. And I thought I'd reached the pinnacle of what modding can do recently with the, uh, the, 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 the RPG faction. But um, the modders have done something again. And it's insane. This is a creation from Omega and Darulin. And in here is a whole bunch of units with random unit costs. 703, 172, 638, etc. And there are hundreds of them. Literally, I'm at 104 units now. Guys, these are randomly generated units and there's hundreds of them let's go over here let's go to the uh we're on the, the legacy map for those of you who don't know see there's a church we're on the legacy map and we're gonna grab some legacy units and we're gonna grab some peasants and we're gonna grab some blow darters why not and some pike people because they're cool and then some poach in the back like that. now let's go to our custom faction let's start with the first unit unit zero let's see what he is oh my god what are you dude Look at this! It's kind of cool looking. He's got this weird giant sash. Half his stuff is glowing. His sword is glowing. He's flying. This is random unit number zero. Let's uh let's fight with him and see what he can do. He goes in and he does some spins. He's got a slam attack. He's rotating non-stop. I bet you if he had cheerleaders, he would turn into a tornado. Absolutely. He's having a hard time doing the attack, and then he died because of the, the, of the poachers did their thing so that's zero now we're gonna add number one and um number one is holding on to a giant pumpkin he's got a spear with some glowing bits and some glowing parts in his chest like he's iron man i wonder what he's going to do he throws the power wow pumpkin did a pretty good job he summons more pumpkins always oh, been shot down by the poacher the poacher was too much for our pumpkin guy and then spinny spinny death death flying guy with the sombrero with the fedora, whatever the hat is, I don't know what the hat is, is continuing to spin in the sky. Having a hard time hitting anything with that sword. It's done decent. Is he gonna win? Or are these blow darters and poachers gonna finish? Mr. Sombrero, Mr. Sombrero, Mr. Mr. Fedora, Mr. Hat Guy coming in, doing a slam. And they managed to win. That's interesting. So there's a one and two. Let's clear this out. Let's grab a number number two. Ha! You know what? I will add a number three. Ha! And number four and i'll put number five over here and number six over here oh no 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 i think um i think we're gonna delete number six for now guys we'll, we'll look at six in a second that that could have been bad um let's take a look okay so over here we have a new guy he looks to be wearing a beautiful glowing like tuxedo and he has ninja stars and a wonderful katana and then over here this guy's wearing a glowing fedora thing again. He's looking suave and debonair, rocking the monkey tail, monkey king tail, and glowing pants, and this really cool looking tunic thing. And then we have giant guy wielding, is that Gandalf staff? Uh oh, he has Gandalf powers. And then we've got a, a, a bowling ball suit guy with glowing Thor helmet. Let's see what happens as I go in and attack. Oh! Glowing sword guy has the, the pharaoh ability, making people bound to him, and he also has the, the, the launching ability of the dark peasant. That's insane. Okay, so I'm, I'm hearing lightning strikes. I don't know where they're coming from. Oh, the wizard staff is firing lightning strikes. Monkey King is doing a bunch of jumping with the monkey tail. Lightning strike from Thor. Blue was victorious. These insane random units are so cool. Um, Let's grab unit number six. Uh, 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 that's, that's terrifying and we'll go oh, number seven grab number seven and we'll add number eight and number nine and number ten and number eleven oh my god what happened to unit number eleven he's ridiculous his one leg is glowing radioactive like some gamma rays hit him his other leg is that of a clown a beautiful yellow clown he is his 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 groinal chest his his stomach region not groin stomach his stomach region is a dragon mouth which is interesting he's got a chili bomb bomb and he's he's got glowing in the chest and he's wearing uh bjorn's helmet along with a plate for a oh it just happened and some kind of oh it's gone it's back it's gone back interesting and then we have this giant guy with a quiver on his side a beautiful little glowing bow and arrow and something going on in his wrist i have an idea a club 
and a cloak. And this guy's wielding the snake bow and a giant glowing sword. And then this guy seems to have the defenses of the dark peasant. <laughs> it's a glowing banjo. Beautiful. His face it looks to be the Bob Ross face and a whole bunch of other things and a pharaoh's staff. This guy's got a gun, a cool looking helmet, a blow darters. And this guy's got a Gatling gun for a hand. He's got a Gatling gun for a hand. This guy's the Gatling gun for a hand and a cheerleader. He's gonna power up his own Gatling gun. Let's see what happens. Let's start. Yep, there goes the hands. Oh, he's got most of Dark Peasant powers. It's over. It's over. This Dark, this dark Peasant guy, like I can remove these. I'm pretty sure the Dark Peasant guy is just gonna dominate all these guys. Dark peasant powers are way too strong. We need we get rid of these guys. We want to see what they did. Soul scrap by number twelve, number thirteen. I can go. I can do this all. Day. Another dark peasant thing. That's so overpowered. Um, glowing sword. Oh, what is that? What, what what is this long thing coming off of him? And what's that? It's a glowing. Oh, that's that's the 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 wrist guards from uh, General Phantom. This guy. Gotch, you can stop this. No, those are glowing crows. My bad, those are glowing crows. And then, ooh, a Truco new weapon glowing. But again, the dark peasant hands are just too strong. Dark, whoa, what was that? Dark peasant hands. Let's just, let's just remove dark peasant. Let's try that again. There was some crazy things going on. The dark peasant launching effect. He sh turned into a vampire. He, he turned into a vampire. The, the, and now he's eating his own snake. And now he's flying away. And he's going to... The big guy turned into a vampire. <laughs> this guy right here turned into a vampire. No way. Look, look. He fires his huacha, fires the snake, turns into a vampire, and then eats his own snake. <laughs> yep, that's the thing, guys. 15. Oh my god. 16. Oh my god. 17. 18. 19. 20. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh, look how majestic he is. It's like a bonsai tree. That bright pink is very much like a glowing bonsai tree. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a clam. He's got a clam. And more glowing clothes. That's cool. Um, Bob Ross. Oh, no, he's a boulder. He's a boulder with awesome glowing neon, not matching colored shoes. And then the blow darter. Oh, General Phantom swords, a gun, and a, a, a balloon pack thing with paintbrush. Guy's got tons of weapons. Here we got the Truco New glowing with the, the crow wings. He's probably going to fly. Over here, you've got a lasso and a stick that's a peasant stick that's awkward i'm sorry you got the sword of the stick there and then we got um um hippie monkey king with a skull because he's badass he on the outside your first glance oh it's a hippie but then you see the skull and you realize actually he doesn't care about the trees he just wants to kill everybody which is really not a good time and then he's got bullets on his back a monkey tail let's just let them fight and see what happens clams are being summoned he's spinning and throwing clams it feels bad this is definitely a low action fight lasso guy is trying to lasso this unit can't aim he, he just can't aim um this unit can't even get close oh oh my god i did not mean to control this unit he's pretty darn fast there now i can, I can throw swords at this guy ha, ha, ha. can't lasso me i'm too fast <laughs> this is actually really fun okay can i shoot him with a right click yeah 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 Oh, aim is off. All right. Just keep hitting the chest with the swords. Hit him in the chest. Oh, I'm a lasso. I pull him. Ah, ha, ha. You lasso me. I lasso you. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This mod is ridiculous. All right, all right, all right. Let's, let's get rid of these guys. I, I gotta see more. I gotta see more. Let's go. 21, 22. Wait a minute. 23. Why is 21 and 22 the same? Fine. 24. There we go. 25, 26, and 27. Going. Oh, there's some fire there. Let's see this guy. He's a. Ooh. Captain's gun. A boxer glove with a. Well, there's multiple boxer gloves there. All right. Samurai helmet, shoulder pads, and beautiful little shoes. He's cute. I like his boots. Those are fantastic. He's rocking the Cupid bow glowing. And this one is the healing staff. Blowing, and he looks kind of like uh, some Russian there. Very Vlad the Impaler. Lasso, boulder, um, vampire cape. I get the feeling this Batman guy is going to turn into a vampire. A little awkward. This guy apparently breathes fire, which is interesting. Glowing shield. This guy's got a sword and a helmet, and he's, he's eating a blade. There's a glowing blade sucked through his mouth. 
because apparently uh, he's not intimidating enough with a giant sword that he needed to chew on a knife to show that he is amazing. And over here, we've got a, a little knife, assassin's knife and a, a, a paddle. You know, to him though, it's so, he's so big, the paddle seems like a riding crop. Going in, beating people with a riding crop. Cupid's arrows are firing. He's trying to heal his teammates while the teammate is, is doing things. Now there's a Cupid arrow doing his thing. Bow, 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 chicken, bow, bow, action. Our pimp over here with the paddle and the knife is having a hard time. Oh, never mind. No, he's not. He's kind of hard. I'm trying to stab the guy with a knife. It's not going so well. Mr. Pimp is doing a bad time. Mr. Pimp is done. These units are insane. I could probably be here all day just digging through this this, this, this mod. 28, 29, 30. A lot of glowing. 31, 32, and 33. There's so much glowing. Glowing crows. He is, guys. Disco stew from the 1970s. Another hand in the sky. He's ready to dance. He's ready to buggy. Over here, you've got Space Soldier. You've got Space Knight. The spear and a boulder. And over here, he's dropped his bow and his sword. And he's got the knife through the throat again. It's a little, a little awkward. And this guy's dropped his, his spear and his halibird. And he's about to fly into the sky. This guy's also dropped his weapons. His pants are glowing. And again, with the, the penis dragon, the stomach dragon going in. Hold on. Hold on. Is this person always oh, paralyzed? Oh, he's a ballista. She's a walking ballista. She can't aim. So many of these dudes don't seem to be doing a whole lot. So what we're going to do now, guys, we're gonna we're gonna set this up. Okay, we're gonna do something stupid. We're gonna do something stupid. I'm gonna grab and from the legacy faction. I'm gonna grab this super person over here. And then from the custom faction, we're just gonna go a couple pages. We're gonna go to a whole new page. 69. I need unit 69. Worth two points. Amazing. Unit 69. He's, he's, he's <laughs> unit 69 is ready to boogie. <laughs> he was dance is amazing. 68, 67, 66, 65, 64, 63. They're just having a whole bunch of these random units from this custom faction. We're going to flood the field with all these different units that do all these different things. And we're going to put them against the present because uh, why not? It's a good time. Here we go. We've got 30 units against the present and it's probably going to end. Oh horribly but look at them they're so beautiful they're so random with their glowing weapons and i'm very glad very very glad especially um, um um badass priest guy here i'm glad that they made them glow double shield guy hello with uh, the pirate hat all oh, these the parrots are glowing i like the fact that everyone's glowing it's like a weird crazy rng neon faction Ooh, you're kind of cool what's, 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 what's going on there what's going on the ground there Big old guy with a barrel for a chest, an executioner hood, a Chuko new shield over here. Oh, there's just, there's so many. <laughs> what is with cactus head tie? I love it. I love it, guys. Super Peasant is about to come and have some fun like that. And you can see, there he is, I found him. You can see the Super Peasant zooming around and completely decimating each and every one of these insane custom units he dives in there i'm trying to follow him i'm actually having a hard time even slow mo keeping up with him keeping him in the center of the frame showing you exactly what he's doing he's not interested in staying in one spot for very long he really just wants to dominate all these people oh man look at, I, i've lost him there he is okay i've got him back oh he's over here he's over here he's over here there he is same concept, this time we're gonna go with the Dark Peasant and we're just gonna drop the Dark Peasant in amongst all of these amazing custom units and he's gonna have a blast. Look, that's insane. All these insane custom units, randomized units being slowly decimated by the Dark Peasant. Guys, it's a very cool mod. It does some very cool things. It's a unique take on modding. Definitely one of the weirdest mods, but also kind of one of the coolest. I kind of really enjoy this mod. Hope you guys like it.